Okay, just a couple of little updates for Simple Lifter. Um, got the screen, uh, dual screen doesn't work uh, everywhere. Yep, um, showing uh, where we're currently at. So again, just some random test data in there. Uh, as you might see though, I've got this thing here called first name surname jpeg and yep, cool. So this is the, the overlay as it, currently at with a oh, interesting set like a, a blank a blank what's the word uh, face hmm placeholder perhaps anyway um, so yeah that, that's that's the current look of the overlay so you know first name surname gets selected uh, we get the bar loaded call and and this pops up now it's kind of cut off a little bit uh, there's a really nice border there but because we've got the white screen in the background it doesn't work very well so um you know let's just i don't know i'll do this um put something on something i can be proud of perhaps anyway so that's what it looks like first name surname comes out yep they do their thing whatever uh good lift no lift we flip to the next person uh, another placeholder yep uh whatever that'll hang up for uh, for a couple of seconds while the lift changes but let's just assume that i don't know we go to someone who i might have a picture of and yeah, there you've got the IPF one, the old one that they, oh, look at that. Ah, so using uh, the, the same kind of file format structure that Open Powerlifting does, you know, the first name, surname with, with no gaps in the names, um, we now have the ability to put up a lifter's profile picture should the lifter choose to upload one onto the system. Uh, now that's not, Let's try again. Let's see if we can get this to come back. Yep. So first name, surname, all lowercase, of course, because, you know, Linux has been picky like that and I'm a lazy coder. Um, but when someone who comes up and we have a picture on, on file for them, we can get something like this now. Uh, the current places, team is empty, totals, all of, all of that other good stuff. And then once again, you, know, you get that bar loaded call and straight away it'll show my face oh i remember that what fun um and it wasn't 300 kilos by the way but yeah so simple lifter you know it, it works with the lights yeah uh, it works with a bunch of other stuff um that you may or may not need as well so if we have a look at the setup option we have options for bench press only competitions this one doesn't work because we've got a bunch of information in there, but you have the ability to set it up for bench press only, just not <laughs> halfway through a competition. Uh, well, I've called it Capo, but um, uh, IPL, I think, uses Glossbrenner, and we've also got the McCulloch age factor in there as well. We've got options now to directly enter male, female, and uh mx i'm sorry i don't remember how to pronounce that mx weight classes um just put the numbers in separated by commas make sure you have a thousand as the final one um for for that to work actually you don't need to put in a thousand it'll it'll just add it if you want that anyway um live stream updates that hasn't changed and none of this stuff really needs to mess with it weight of bar and collars so if you're doing a 25 kilo squat bar let's quickly change that to 30 and then change it back again um, the add lifter button works properly if you need to remove a lifter make sure you remove the name and the lot number so to make sure that you don't accidentally delete someone when you're just deleting one cell you have to have a blank for the name and the lot number and and they will go um, what other things have we I don't think we've really changed much the results still do the same thing um, uh, the scoreboard remains the same. The, the live platform display now has the option to display that, uh, according to IPF rules, which is only by lot number rather than sorting by lifting order. Um, yep, not much else, not much else has changed. Just wanted to show you something I'm really proud of. Uh, it was suggested to me, Hey, why don't you just do that? And I'm like, yeah, you know what? Why don't I? Um, and I need to stop flicking between names so quickly, uh, otherwise it doesn't quite work.
there. Even yeah, even if you were to change it halfway through, um, it'll catch up. But obviously, try not to do that because it reloads the animation every time. Uh, you're gonna piss people off. I like the transparency. You can change all of that. You know, you can just jump into OBS. Uh, I'm not going to do it now. Um, but if you know the CSS code, you can just change it. You can change the color scheme, do whatever you want. Um, and the other really cool thing, uh, please work. It's all on GitHub now. Um, I figured mainly for the issues, you know, if there's uh, problems and suggestions, um, you know, it's a really good way for me to know what people want, uh, as well as, you know, I can write things down. So when we have problems with comps, I can get in there and, oh yeah, fix that, fix that, fix that, fix that. Uh, like, um, Why not? You know, people have asked me about it. But yeah, get on to github.com slash meathead slash simple lifter. You can see it in the uh, top left there. Uh, doing this live. Yeah, it's gonna, oh, it's not gonna work. I can't, I can't resize enough. Meathead simple lifter. Yep, get on it. Um, because the more people who help me understand what they need, um, the better it's going to be for everyone. Um, don't forget, it's all completely free. cotf.zapto.org. Completely free. Um, yeah. You know, it's been used quite a bit, as you can see. Uh, going to build some stuff to... Yeah, sort all this out so you can have one comp rather than like we've done here. But that was something that I had to hard code. Uh, something like that. Um, yeah, get behind it. You know, why not? It's completely free. I'm trying to make it easier for everyone to do live streams and competition management, like platform management. Instead of having five people, you have one doing paperwork, collecting cards and typing it into the computer. It really is that simple um so yeah any any questions hit me up uh, any issues with the lights the timers simple lifter the overlays anything get on that github thing and you know we can write it down and talk about it at least and you can see how dodgy all of the code is and you know give me uh some help fixing things up perhaps so uh yeah cheers eh and uh happy lifting <laughs>